You know what the best thing you could do right now is to rest. All right, just why don't you have a seat over here? Here you go. I want to make us some tea. All right? Does that make you feel better? Michelle, everything's going to be all right. It will, sweetie. I really need to get a hold of Danny. I do. Well, can't that wait? I mean, I'm sure he's going to be home any second. He'll probably try to call you himself. And quite frankly, after his behavior this morning, you know, maybe it's better that Danny's not here. It's, maybe it's better. Um, you know, maybe you should rest at my place. What do you think? I'm sure it's fine right where she is, Claire. In her home with her husband. The other one is not needed here. I was just trying to help yeah, Michelle. I know what you were trying to do. Claire. I'd like to be alone with my wife, if you don't mind. Claire, thank you for everything you've done today. No problem. Michelle, please. Look, I'm going to be right next door if you need me. All right? What's going on? Why did she say you need to rest? You all right? Where were you? I tried calling you for hours. I, mean, I told you, I had to track down David Grant to discuss my mother's case. I finally found him at Towers. Ran to Jesse. He started giving me grief because I want to find who killed my mother. I mean, honestly, I don't know why all of you think I'm choosing that over taking care of you and our baby. I don't. Well, you don't have to choose. Well, yes, because one thing has nothing to do with the other. I'm glad you... And you don't have to choose because there's no choice to make, Danny. Why, why are you talking like that? What do you mean? What's going on? I just got back from the hospital. Why were you at the hospital? Honey. What? Um, don't tell I me. I lost me. No. I tried calling you. I didn't know where you were. I lost me. Honey. be happening to us. and it didn't even get worse until after... When? When? After Carmen was shot. Honey. When I fell. I wish you had told me. You should have told me. You should have... It, it went away. Until today. And I really thought that I was fine. I really did. And you had so much to worry about and you were so upset and I didn't want to add to that. Oh, come on. You should have told me. I wish I'm sorry. I wasn't at the hospital. I would have been there. If I had known, I would have... I'm just glad you're here now. Was, was Claire with you at the hospital? Why oh, was that okay? Mm -hmm. Yeah, she was great. She really pulled through. Good. I'm good. I'm glad. Danny, where were you? I was at Towers. I was talking to David Grant. Uh, oh, God, I wish I was with you. I wish I was with you. Sorry. dreams of that wonderful life that we were going to give this child, the three of us. And now I feel like, I feel like that may never happen. No, don't say that. We'll have that life. I promise you we will. We will. We will. So I'll 
I'll just take some time to get past this. And we will. When you're feeling better, honey, we'll try again. I don't know if I can think about that right now. Okay, I, I understand. I, I was just... Forget it, forget it. I feel so... empty. And I cannot help but have this awful feeling that this is some kind of a sign. What do you mean? Huh? A sign. A sign that, that things are never going to turn out right for us. Michelle. Come on, if this is a sign of anything at all, it's just that... It's just that something was wrong with the baby. It's, it's just nature's way of, of taking care of things. You don't think this was some kind of an omen? Oh, no, no, I do not. No, and yeah, by working through this together, it only make us stronger and clearer about what we want and more determined to make that happen. Well, I think that we were under too much stress trying to find out who killed Carmen. And I know how much of a pull that is for you. But honey, you become a different person and I was really scared. And maybe the baby says that and that's why. I'm sorry. I'm... walk away like that? It's really, it's not his decision to make, honey. It's not. So, so you're a threat to them now because you have information? Well, Carl, all he wants is my family's business and I gave it to him. That's all he's interested in. And, and you realize that once you sever your ties with these people, you may never know who killed Carmen. Mm -hmm. Are you, are you going to be able to live with honey, that? you're the most important thing in my life. And I don't want you to ever doubt that ever again. Okay. 